This is Professor Fred Kennedy from the Ebo Valley College in Pleasant Hill, California. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to create a visual C++ 2008 Express project that you can use to write, compile, and debug your 32-bit assembly language programs. And I'm also going to show you how to add a file to the program. To create a new project, click on File, New, Project, expand the Visual C++ selection, click on Win32, click on Win32 console application, and enter the name of your project here. I'm just going to call this Proj1. Now the Proj1 project will be created under the directory in location here, which means when I finish it will be c colon backslash compsci 260 backslash proj1. You can put your own location directory name in here and if the directory is not created it will be created. So I click OK and then in the Win32 application wizard I click on application settings. Console application should already be selected and then I'm going to check the box empty project because we want to create a project with no files and then I click on finish. And now we have our empty project. In order to finish this off to work with assembly language, you have to right click on the project name, click on custom build rules, and check the box Microsoft Macro Assembler. If you don't check this box, you won't be able to compile your assembly language programs. Click on OK. Now we want to add a source file to our program. So click on source files, right-click on source files and click on add new item or existing item. If we already have an assembly language file we want to add to this, we can click on existing item and browse to where the file is and put it into our project. Today we're going to create a new assembly language file. So we click on new item. Once again expand the Visual C++ selection, click on code, click on CPP file and put the name of our file in here. Even though we selected .cpp file, we can create an assembly language file by typing the name here and call it any name you like. I'm just naming it after my project. I'm going to call my file proj1, but the important part is to add on the .asm extension here. And If you don't add on the .asm extension, it will add .cpp, which you don't want. The location of the file will be under our project directory, c colon backslash compsci 260 proj1 here. Click on add. The editor pops up. We have a blank document where we can start, start typing our code and we're all ready to go here. 